Okay, so today we're going to show you how to change your DNS if you have problem in connecting with the the, the website. Okay, so basically uh, what's happening here, some of students who use Studio R, they were unable to connect with the server that allows them to download the necessary packages. So right now we're going to show you how to change your DNS setting so that you can uh, get access to the to the respective link. So click on your control panel, click on network and internet. So when you click on network and internet, you can see that you can see these options. Okay, so you can click view network uh, status and tasks. This is your area. Okay, so right now what you're going to do, you're going to change the setting for your e internet. Okay, so the internet. <coughs> so you have to go to your respective uh, network access. So um, since for me, I'm using uh, the Wi-Fi. So sorry, I'm using the cable. I'm going to change the setting with cable. So I think you can see that it's now open. I click on the network connections. Okay. So you for me this one, I will check right click properties. So under properties, okay. So you, this is my setting for my. Uh, network okay this is my network uh, controller the gigabit ethernet controller okay so i'm going to scroll this thing down to internet protocol version 4 so under internet protocol version it change properties okay as you can see mine is already set for the google dns so it's already set for google dns which is 8888 8844 okay so that is the dns setting which uh, we change okay so th therefore i don't have much problem with internet access because i my dns is using the google dns the same thing for the wi-fi okay we right click on the wi-fi go to internet protocol version 4 click properties okay here what you do you just change it to become 8 Eight, eight, eight. The other one is eight, eight, four, four. So you are forcing them to use this DNS. What does the DNS stand for? Is domain name server. Eh? Is domain name server. So basically, it's like a phone book that you check uh, to see what, where is the appropriate IP addresses of the addresses that you want to go. So this is the best uh, to use Google DNS. Okay. And with that, thank you very much. And by right, since this one it has happened, you should not have any problem in accessing any of the uh, URL. Okay, to check what you can do, you just click type, type CMD. Okay, so this is the CMD. Okay, this one shows you the uh, everything. So, so this is IP config, IP config slash all. So this is the setting for my internet. So you can see that everything is connected. So what is important here, you can see here the DNS server is set at 8844. Okay. Uh, so I don't have much problem. Okay. So whenever I want to access a certain address, for example, I want to go to Google. Eh? So I can just try ping google.com. Okay. So Google IP address is 172.217.166.142 and I can ping it no problem. So that is the, uh, use, the use of this DNS. Eh? Allows you to check, to convert all the addresses to become. Okay, so what is the problem here? The problem is uh, a very specific address on Studio R. So okay, what is the Studio R near link? It is crunrstudio.com. Crunrstudio.com. Okay, so I'm going to ping. Ping. Crun, C R A N, Crun, R Studio, R Studio.com. Okay, so you can see here, I have no problem in accessing the Studio R uh, site. Okay, so I can download all the packages from the Studio R, uh, no problem. Okay, because I have so for those who are having problem 
what you can do you go you can open up your command uh, cmd your com uh, cli command line interface the command prompt so you type in the, the ping scranrstudio.com you press enter if it does not come back then means you have problem with your uh, dns and then you should change your dns the way i demonstrated earlier on okay with that thank you very much